All right, how gay am I, guys? Let's find this out. I hear a Beyonce song. I don't listen to Beyonce too much. I like Run the World. Do you enjoy consensual sexual experiences with or with feel sexual attraction to members of the same sex? The problem here is I'm asexual. <laughs> this is unfortunate. Uh, <laughs> I have to say never because I, it, it's quite literally. Wine just sounds fancy. Okay, just to clarify, do you like- I, I don't like having sex! It doesn't matter if it's with the same gender or not. Quiz. This is the closest I can get to gaming. Oh my god. It's only asking about sex. This is not an asexual friendly quiz. Your questions are weird. Why are fucking hello? What what US president do I kin? Um I think the fruitiest one here is JFK. Screw your box. This is the worst quiz I've ever taken in my life. I'm kind of rocking with box three. What the fuck? A plane leaves New York at 4.15 p.m. local time, bound for London, traveling at 500 miles per hour. Another plane leaves London at 9.30 p.m. local time, heading in the opposite direction and traveling at 550 miles per hour. I mean, a constant airspeed. Do you ever want to have sex with someone of the same sex? Quiz! I'm a sexual quiz, please! This quiz does not represent me at all. Fuck you. How gay am I? Traditional me labels are meaningless. Okay, gay, straight, male, female. There's a lot more in this world than blunt terms you encompass. You get to find yourself and you're free to separate your sexuality or lack of. It, it, it kind of, it kind of, um, acknowledged me being ace. However you choose, hurrah. A little waste of my time. Okay, let's, let's do, I don't. What the fuck is an ad calling me chronically online? This is the worst day of my life. You get one point for each you check. Your total number of points determines your straight number, and that number determines if you are gay or straight. It's science. It's your favorite song, Britney Spears. Wait, is your favorite Britney Spears song Toxic? It is not, but I fucking love Britney Spears. Um, I don't only know Call Me Maybe by Carly Rae Jemsen, but I don't know what I would say is my favorite song of hers. Um, I've never been to a- I've been to like a wedding years ago and then didn't play this. Is perfect by Ed Sheeran the perfect first dance for a song on a webbing? No idea what that is. Um, do I like Ed Sheeran? I don't hate Ed Sheeran. Uh, I wouldn't say I'm a fan, but I think he has a good voice. I'll say yeah. I never played Giant Jenga. Have you not posted a new Instagram picture in over a year? No. Do you have empty liquor bottles? No, because I don't drink. Do you have an inspiration to post? An yes, because I live with my mom. Um, <laughs> no. Do you use the word buddy to- no. Do you refer to into offense as my man? No. Do you refer to babies as little man or little bud? Um, little dude. So it's close enough. Can you open a bottle? Never done that before. Do you love St. Patrick's Day? Who does? Um, you ever presented in SantaCon? What the fuck is that? Do you own a Kakusa Qatar? No. Have you ever brought- brought- no, I don't own one. Do you love grilling? I'm not a dad. My hand is not down my pants right now. Um, I can- you can't see, but I can promise my hand is not down my pants right now. Um, I do love karaoke. Um, I don't like walking slow. Do you- I don't like coffee at all. Is it a sin to drink? I don't know. I don't care. Do what you want. I don't drink iced coffee at all. Do you drink glasses of milk? No. I used to, but not anymore. Do you hear the word poppers? Do you think of the food? Yes, jalapeno poppers. Are you the word Rob? No, I think of Stranger Things, but not spelt like that. That's not even how the bird is spelt. Do you still like- I never- I'm not a big fan of Justin Timberlake. Do you find out Lady Gaga could sing- Do you just find out Lady Gaga could sing in the past few years? Who the fuck thought she couldn't? I don't really know any other color clock songs, so sure. I've never participated in gender reveal. I don't have a friend named Cheese. Um, are any of you guys named Cheese? We're going to change your name to that. Do a fish concert. Don't know who that is. What about the Grateful Dead? Do you know who that is? Haven't been to one. Have you ever stolen a traffic cone? No, but now I need to. Do you love Queer Eye? Never seen it. Have you taken a picture with a fish? No. Do you have an American flag in your living room? No. Do you want a man cave? I want a gaming cave. No. I don't love the show Friends. I've never seen that movie. Do you make margarita? I don't drink. Have you ever used the word hubby? No. What's my results? Yes, baby! Oh, we passed! We passed! We know your height based on your dessert options. Let's see. I'm gonna be really offended if it's just I'm like 4'10 or something. Desserts is best. Cookies, pastries, pie, ice cream, candy, cake. Um, I am a cookies fan. So that's chocolate dessert. Um, brownies. This fruit dessert, pie, sorbet, pastry with 
fruit filling, fruit flavored cake, fruit flavored ice cream. I don't like fruit stuff. Uh, pastry with fruit filling. Pick a cake, chocolate vanilla, red velvet, carrot, uh, red velvet. Pick a pie. Uh, I like pumpkin pie. Pick a creamy dessert, cheesecake, tiramisu, chocolate mousse. That's how you say it right? Gelato creme brulee, uh, cheesecake. Candy bar gummies, sour gummies. Ooh, sour gummies. It got close. It got close. Let's see how old I am with desserts as well. Oh, these must- We're gonna go cookies. We're gonna go cookies. Apple, papaya fritters, crumble, turnovers, pie. 14! <laughs> but we can see what age I really am based on the cupcake I build. Can we share it with- It's a cupcake! Let's we make multiple. I'm not sharing a singular. My best friend, my spouse, my significant other, my sorority sisters, frat bros, my cat, <laughs> my mom or dad, my kids, my class, my my fucking cat, bro. 14 and 16! Why? I'm not- <laughs> That's not a 14 or a 16 year old in that picture. I'm 19! I'm a 19 year old woman. Is that, I thought that was Ludwig for a second. <laughs> Did you know we can tell when jobs are perfect for you based on the way you finish these words? Guys, it's gonna tell me if I should be a streamer or not. Okay, um, death, bold, pain, eight, hate, sink, <laughs> cock, mock, hung, beast, jail, ghost, neck, teal. Do you think, do you guys think I'd be a good teacher? <laughs> You're a deep thinker. An empathetic person, bro. I chose like pain and death for most of those. I mean, I do think I'm a good person that tries to understand others, but please do not put me in a teaching position. Like, I would be in front of like middle schoolers that will like call me like a bitch and then I'd start crying. Which season should people wear these? I'm just gonna pick my name every time. Autumn. 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 Saying my name over and over again is very weird to me. <laughs> I did not look at the results at all. <laughs> Sapphic books! Holy shit, this is important. We're gonna plan- this is gonna be my, my college experience for next year, guys. What is your roommate like? Uh, I'd rather have a single TBH. How do you spend your free time? Where's gaming? Loser, god, I'm not a- oh, These are loser shit, real- <laughs> Real cool kids game. Most important feature have your college. Um, engaging classes probably. And why are you going to college? To be honest, it's just what people expect me to do. To be honest, love is for losers. By I don't know how to say that. Fifty year old Phoebe thinks she's fall falling in love is vile and degrading, and vows to never do it. Then, due to circumstances not entirely in her control, she finds herself volunteering at a local thrift shop. She meets Emma, who might unwittingly spend her whole theory on life. This is a laugh out loud exploration of sexuality, family, friendly. Female friendship, grief, and community with the heart and hilarity of Netflix critically game Sex Education. Brugerman's sex positive debut is prior to reading for Generation Z teens. Can that's like, yeah, can I, I feel like that sounds like a cute book, TBH. <laughs> Which of my favorite bands do you like? No, we're gonna judge this person. We're gonna judge Snorlax1230. What pants do you listen? That's okay. <laughs> Animated gals kiss or diss? Cool. <gasps> oh, baby, we're kissing. Marge Simpson. Okay, Marge can kind of get it. TBH. Yeah, Marge, Marge can kind of get it. <gasps> oh, Megara. Ooh, kiss. Other Gothel. No. Nah. Uh, Elsa is pretty and definitely a lesbian. Jane, I haven't seen Tarzan, so I don't really know. I am gonna say diss because I don't really know her. <laughs> Raya. Oh no, she is kind of gay. Oh, have you seen this? I don't know if you've seen this movie. She does kind of have like an enemies to lovers type beat with the other girl. Um, so we're gonna kiss. She kind of. Oh, Fiona. Be nah, I don't care. We're kissing Fiona. Human. No, nope, no, nope, we're getting both of them. We're taking both human and ogre Fiona. I don't care what you say. Ellie from Up. Um, I don't want to take her from uh the other guy. So. Ooh, hi, Elastic Girl. We're kissing you for sure. Mirage, I don't remember this guy. Was she one of the villains? I don't really care about you, so I'm gonna diss. Wonder Woman? Oh, she can kind of get it, TBH. I'm saying kiss. 
Okay, I don't- I've never seen Atlantis, but I know people have crushes on her, for sure. And, you know, she's pretty. <laughs> we're going to bed. Oh, hi, Nani. We're kissing Nani from Lilo and Stitch. She is so pretty. Oh, hi, Rapunzel. Um, this will- this is after she turns 18. After she turns 18? On her 18th birthday? Kiss. Mm, I have to say diss on her. Most people did. That was a great list. Here, let's smash her pass. Let's do a smash her pass. Smash Steve. Every- okay, everyone wants to smash Steve Roberts, so most people agree. How do we feel about Tony Stark? I have my opinion on what I would- what I would say. Okay, I'm glad we're all saying pass because I agree. Natasha Romanoff, Black Widow. You guys are saying pass? Really? Oh, I would have said smash. No, screw you guys. I'm- we're, I'm saying smash. See, they- the, the, the masses agree. Do you guys want to smash or pass Thor? Wait, really? I thought you guys were in a smash. You guys want to pass? Smash fat Thor, pass for not fat. You know, based. Definitely based. Wanda Maximoff. How do we feel about Wanda, gamers? I think Wanda's pretty. She's gorgeous. I love her. But she's too in love with Vision. And is kind of insane. So, <laughs> how do I feel about Loki? Pass. Okay, I'm glad we're all in pass. Because I'm sorry, but I don't find um, Tom Hilson. I don't find him attractive at all. Okay, Peter Quill. Pass. Okay. We'll pass, we'll pass. Yeah, it's kinda- Eh, more people pass. How do you feel about Bruce Banner? Oh, Jesus Christ, Beef. <laughs> beef really likes Bruce Banner. Majority rules, we'll do Smash. Ooh, what do we about- what do we feel about T'Challa? I have my own answer for T'Challa. Smash, Smash- Okay, I'm glad we're all in agreement. <laughs> How do we feel about Ant-Man? Paul Rudd, Ant-Man. <laughs> so Beef- Beef would apparently Smash. I don't think he's unattractive. He's attractive, but pass. How do I feel about Carol Danvers, Captain Marvel? Okay, I'm not a, I'm not a Captain Marvel hater. I just didn't think she was Captain Marvel's that interesting. But it's not because she's a woman. So I'll give a pass. That's a 50-50 dang. All right, let's get let's get one more quiz in. Any chat suggestions on like a last quiz to do? Another you know, Smasher pass. Smasher pass of people of history. You guys are gonna decide on these. <laughs> All right, chat. Smash or pass? Isaac Newton. Smash. I love gravity. <laughs> Karl Marx. <laughs> we got two smashes. We got two smashes and a pass. Sappho. Jesus, there's a lot. There's 38. Jesus. I mean, it's Sappho. She is kind of really pretty. Can I have my own opinion on this? <laughs> we got one pass, but one smash. We wrote some poetry. And we're, and we're, we're smashing Sappho. That's based. Mary, Queen of Scots. And we're for sure passing. Yeah, everyone everyone was on agreement here. <laughs> I'm feeling about John John Dark. How the fuck do you say that? Smash pass our girl boss. <laughs> and we're girl boss. We're girl bossing. Ludwig von Beethoven. <laughs> okay, we got a two immediately. Okay, we are that was everyone wants to smash Beethoven, okay. <laughs> Edgar Edgar Allan Poe. It's it's a smash. We're smashing Edgar Allan Poe. Ras how do we feel about Rasputin? <laughs> We got three smashes. The only person who wants to pass is Boo. Sun Tzu. <laughs> we got two votes for Smash. Boo's the only one who knows the history behind these people. I know some of them. Bro, that's- <laughs> I guess we're smashing Sun Tzu. <laughs> Henry VIII. <laughs> we got Smash Pass or the Wife Killer? <laughs> we got two votes for the Wife Killer. One pass. How do we feel about William Shakespeare, gamers? Immediate smashes. Imme oh, we're smashing William Shakespeare. Marie Antoinette. Either smash pass, I'd rather eat cake. Haha, <laughs> get it? Pass? Alright. Marilyn Monroe. Mm. Really? You guys are passing Marilyn Monroe. It's not what I expected at all. Alright, chat. How do we feel about Stalin? <laughs> you know, I was gonna say we're all in agreement except for beef, I guess. <laughs> I can fix him. Oh no. Amelia Earhart. We got two. Okay, we're apparently gonna be passing Amelia Earhart. Sorry, Amelia. HP Lovecraft. <laughs> Oh no! Pass, pass. <laughs> Hard pass. Sigmund Freud. <laughs> Alright, we're passing- I'm not his mother! <laughs> oh, oh my god. Alright, we're passing Sigmund Freud. How do we feel about- It's Al Capone, right? I recognize the name. Isn't- I think this is a bad guy? I don't really remember. Alright, we're passing Al Capone. I have no idea who the hell this guy is, but we're apparently- apparently we can't him. <laughs> Epi oh, it's epic rap battles of history. Okay, that makes more sense. 